On January 30, 1991, a team of Canadian CF-18s targeted an Iraqi patrol boat. The ship-based controller questioned the crew that day, would anyone wish to strafe a boat? And the Canadian pilots didn't think twice. The boat previously avoided a strike from an A-6 intruder when the aircraft ran out of weapons. Both of the Canadian pilots fired their 20mm cannons during several strafing runs after getting the go-ahead for action. They attempted to get an IR lock to fire an AIM-9 Sidewinder missile as they were down to their last few air-to-air -air weapons. However, because the boat's heat signature was too low, the pilot had difficulty getting a radar lock, so he chose to fire a radar-guided AIM-7 Sparrow. The enemy boat was not hit by the $250,000 missile, it impacted the water instead. Although U.S. aircraft ultimately wiped out the boat, the Canadians were formally recognized for their help in the seaworthiness kill. In the very first military action by Canada since the Korean War, they wasted a $250,000 air-to-air missile on a boat, which upset the commander of the Canadian Air Task Group in the Middle East.